Next time I'm gonna take off the tips and just do my regular nails because they're getting a little long but I get dip on top of my tips and I like the dip but I don't necessarily like it on top of tips because they don't last as long they tend to like lift up from the back so when I went in I was missing two nails and it had only been maybe two and a half weeks because I was trying to stretch it I didn't want to get my nails done in between the last time I got it done and my show but other than that, I do like it. It's not bad. I'm not wearing gold at all. I just got gold because I like it better than silver. I'm definitely wearing silver on Saturday, but it's okay. Um, the judges won't even be able to see it, to be honest. I'm about to go do a video shoot, and I'll take you all along for that. And I'm about to eat. I don't want to show you my food because it looks so gross. I have four boiled eggs, and then I have some ground chicken and ground turkey mix. So what I did was I cooked my ground chicken and turkey together and then i put a little taco seasoning on it to give it some added flavor i don't oh it smells horrible but yeah i don't know if y'all can see that it looks really weird but i promise it's pretty good it's not bad at all will i eat it when i'm not on prep yes but not like this i would eat the ground chicken and turkey mix maybe on some type of tacos or separate not from not with eggs necessarily i have so much stuff to do this week i have to do all the maintenance type stuff hair nails waxes all that all that jazz so we're gonna go ahead and do that but yeah let me go ahead and eat this and then i will see you all at the video shoot All done it is hot 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 i hope you all can hear me i'm just burning up so you can even see the sweat on my face so what i did was i put oil on my skin <laughs> to kind of give me more of a glowy look but on my face this is the actual oil that my skin produced i have the oiliest skin ever so i'm just trying to get some ac because it's so oily but yeah i was supposed to update you all let me turn this down supposed to update you all on my meal plan um so on 
Sunday, my coach texted me and he was like, hey, you have some changes coming your way. And I was like, uh, what type of changes? He's like, your meal plan is gonna change. So I was like, okay. So at first I was doing three days of no carbs and then one day of carbs. And then I just kept doing that. I think I did that for maybe, I don't know, two weeks, something like that. So I did that, but now he's having me do a fat cycle zero carbs so on friday no on thursday so last thursday today is tuesday so i'm in peak week uh, last thursday is when i got carbs so friday saturday sunday no carbs then he sends me my new meal plan on sunday and he says no carbs for the rest of the week at least until thursday so i don't know if i'm gonna be able to get carbs on friday Fingers crossed. i'm gonna do a fat cycle starting monday so yesterday Friday is to be determined. As far as cardio, Monday, 90 minutes, Tuesday, 80 minutes, Wednesday, 60 minutes, Thursday, 45 minutes, and then no cardio on Friday. <sighs> so yeah. And then on Friday, I have no idea what he's gonna do on Friday. I'm nervous. I hope he tells me I can eat carbs because honestly, all I want is some Ezekiel bread with some almond butter and a banana on top. That'd be nice. Or I don't even have to eat the banana. Just give me like Ezekiel bread and almond butter. I'll be good. Hey guys, so I just finished getting a wax. Um, I did a Brazilian. So literally they take, whoa sorry they take everything off and then i was gonna do my underarms but she said that it's not ready to be waxed just yet so she gave me this like exfoliator it's called their slow polish basically she told me to use it she just gave me some samples to use and then come back on friday and hopefully i should be good to go to get my underarms waxed the only thing is friday is the same day as my spray tan and i don't want to have a reaction so hopefully i don't because I like to get waxes two to three days before the spray tan. So that way I know that my skin is healed and nothing will happen. But I hope I don't have any type of reaction. But that's the only other wax I have to get. Tomorrow I'll have a photo shoot. So I'm going to bring you all along for that. I think it's really nice to do at least a photo shoot or a video shoot or something. Um, while you're on prep or towards the end. It's for memories. Because you're not going to be this lean forever. Even after prep, you have to gain a little bit of weight during your off-season. And then you'll get lean again. So I just want to document it. And I just want to, like, get some really good pictures while I look like this. <laughs> because I know after, I'll probably put on about 10 to 15 pounds. I think that'll be pretty comfortable for me. But, yeah, I'm about to go get a pedicure. I'll take you all along for that. I'm just going to get a French tip. Keep it very simple, very basic. My toes don't look bad now, but I feel like the white, the tip is a little bit too thick. So I'm going to have him thin out the line a little bit. And I should be good for the day. That's pretty. Oh, I have to meet with my coach later today. He wants to see me, see how I look in person. Um, but other than that, after that, I'm good. I can go home and relax for the rest of the day. I'ma make a better way. Hey, hey. Already got the world on me. Give a pretty brown girl a space. You can keep your head. I'ma make a better way. Hey, hey. Better way. So my coach did send me an updated version of my meal plan. So Friday is going to be high fats. So it's what I talked about earlier in the video, how I get a lot more nuts and salmon, just fats throughout the day, which I enjoy because it makes me feel full since I can't eat any carbs. And then on Saturday, it's going to be my normal meal plan. So my Ezekiel bread, I get so excited thinking about that. I get to put some almond butter on it, grapefruit. He's also gonna add in some rice cakes. Um, and I think, that's pretty much it. I get coconut water to prevent cramps. I cannot talk. <laughs> um, what else? I think that's it. But if anything changes, I'll let you all know.
my food as much oh he did make me do carb cycling so like for three days i got no carbs and then one day i got carbs That's and awesome. then i haven't had carbs since thursday what was that today thursday no last thursday Jeez, so like no bread no rice nothing so what are you doing no today? fruit no fruit yeah carbs what is like the taste buds doing right now they're craving a lot right now they're like shayla feed me maybe feed me. <laughs> I'm sorry to hear that.
wanna know me, I stay low key. Y'all gas, no breaks, baby. Let them hoes sleep. Body on to make your girl OD. I get in my way, never out of my lane. Feel like you the one and I'm on one. So what is gonna be? Baby squad up, we finna go deep. Is you riding on a team? Got what you need. Baby, won't you keep me company? Give me something to do when I get low. You should side with me, stay solid one time if you lie with me. Just promise you never lie to me. Keep the moves on tuck, I know it's all love. Everything good, keep the vibes on crush. I know it's all good. Know it's all love, know it's all love. I've been feeling like I'm feeling like the man. So I'm officially one day out. Tomorrow is the big day. So I'm actually about to go get a spray tan and I'm running a little bit behind because I just got to the hotel. So I think it's like 5.50 and my spray tan is at 6.15. But the good thing is that it's here in the hotel. So um, I can easily just go downstairs, get the spray tan and then come back up to my room. But I wanna show you all how I prep for the spray tan because you wanna make sure you're exfoliating and making sure your skin is ready for it. It looks so much better when you do have a spray tan. So I am going to show you all the products that I use really fast and I'm gonna hop in the shower and then I'm gonna go get my spray tan. I always get my spray tan kind of late. That way um, I feel clean all day tomorrow because I can't take another shower until tomorrow, maybe around 10 o'clock, 10, 11. Because after you get your spray tan, you can't shower, you can't put on lotion, you can't put on deodorant, perfume. All those hygiene products, you cannot use. I'm out of breath. <laughs> gonna shower with this native body wash right here um you don't want it they say don't use anything too moisturizing this is all i had so hopefully that works i don't want to turn green and they say don't wear anything red because the red dye will turn will turn your uh, spray tan green so i was like oh that's interesting didn't know that to shave really fast i should have shaved the day before but i didn't so it's okay we're gonna do it today and then before i do all of that uh, well, before I shave, I'm going to exfoliate my legs and arms and like shoulders and stuff with this tree hut. I don't even know if it'll focus, but yeah, it's just a tree hut shea sugar scrub. Hopefully you all can see this better. Yeah, you can. Okay. So here's the native. I'm going to use this shaving cream and then I'm going to wash my face with La Roche Posay and I am going to exfoliate my lady parts with this, um, what's it, what is it called? European Wax Center Slow Body Polish. It's a little bit more gentle, so I don't want to use a sugar scrub. I'd rather use this on the areas that I get waxed, so my Brazilian and my underarms. And then on my face, huh? I might not put anything on my face. So after you shower, you can't put on any moisturizer, you can't put on any deodorant, you can't put anything on your body. You have to just be bare. And when you go 
get your spray tan, you're completely naked. So what's gonna happen is I'm about to, after I shower, I have to put on my bikini, go check in. They have to look at my bikini to make sure that, or my wellness suit, to make sure that it's appropriate because you can't wear any thongs or anything when you're an amateur and it has to cover a certain amount of your butt. And then I have to take that off, get my spray tan, and then I'm just gonna come back up to the room and chill for the rest of the night. But I wanted to quickly show you all that because honestly, you should be exfoliating throughout the entire week to make sure your skin is properly prepped for your actual spray tan so it goes on nice and smooth and I know a lot of people they shave their entire body arms chest back like everything is completely smooth I just do underarms Brazilian and then I'll shave my legs with the shaving cream and that's good enough for me but do as you please on the less hair the better for sure but it's completely up to you what you feel comfortable doing but yeah let me go hop in the shower i'm gonna try to take you all along with me to check in and i can't take you into the spray tan room but i'm gonna see if i can get some footage if i don't i'm sorry but i'll try my best <laughs> fitting pullover that I've had since college and then I put on some joggers and I just have on Crocs and so this is what I'm gonna wear because I don't care if it gets dirty or anything so you just want to make sure whatever you wear it might get spray tan on it um, so I'm gonna just go down get my spray tan and then I'll show you all what it looks like because I'm gonna be a few shades darker now, I don't get my face spray tan um, I just get darker makeup for that but all right it's time to go Oh, and I also have on my bikini. Oh, no, yeah, you're okay. How are you doing? Yeah, I'm good. Yes. All right. So what we got here today? Get all your classes that you wanted. Novice, yes. Open. And then open C. Yes. Anything that, else? Nope. That is all. Okay. Let me. See. Have your signature right there and okay. 1014 right there. Okay. There you go. Now you want to give back to the judges so they get your number. Okay. But you want to keep this. This is your okay. lanyard. And these are your vouchers for your t-shirt and your goodie bag tomorrow. Perfect. So you might want to keep those. Okay. Thank you so <laughs> you much. Okay. Thank you. Excuse me. So I have my spray tan. It's actually pretty good. I like it. And then here's my stomach. And then they have you put like cuticle lotion or I don't know, there's a name for it. This lotion on your fingers and on your nails so that way it doesn't get on your nails. So like my nails and my hands, oh, they're ashy, but they're not brown because they had me put that lotion on my nails and my hands. My nails and my hands on my feet and my hands. My feet are a little bit darker. My hands and my feet are darker than the rest of my body. So but other than that, and I should be leaner in the morning. I'm hoping that when I wake up in the morning, I'm much, much tighter. So I have a feeling that this video is gonna be kind of long because I had so much to show you all, but I will see you all in my next video. And the next video will be show day. Um, I'm excited, I'm ready. At first I was a little bit nervous because earlier today I was super bloated and 
I was kind of down about it. I was like, dang, why am I so swollen and bloated? I almost didn't want to get on stage. I know that's so dramatic, but my stomach was like out here. And my coach was like, keep drinking water, keep drinking water, keep drinking water, drink some tea, you'll be fine, you'll be fine. And now everything's starting to go down and I should wake up much tighter in the morning because he's cut my water to where um, I can only have sips now. And then tomorrow I can literally only have like a teeny tiny bit and that is it. But today I can drink it as needed. And then um, tomorrow I go back on my normal meal plan. I feel like I told you all that, but I'll eat nor my normal food, my Ezekiel bread, almond butter. I'll eat some rice cakes to kind of pull more water out of me. Uh, so those dry carbs help do that. I'll eat probably some sunflower seeds, some, let's see, rice, chicken, all that good stuff. But yeah, that is it. I am going to relax and chill for the rest of the night because I got to get up at four o'clock. I'm gonna get my makeup done at five, but I'm getting up at four because I got to get content. <laughs> um, I, I have to, I just want to take my time because I'm going to be recording in the morning. So I want to make sure I'm prepared because I know once I start getting my makeup done, I'm going to be sitting down. I'm not going to be able to do too much. And my friend's going to come and help me record as well. So I'm going to wake up, take my time, have that time for myself, get all my cameras set up. Well, I just have my iPad and my phone, get those set up in different angles. And then once my friend gets here, she'll be able to get even more angles for me. So that way she, I can record. And then um, I'll get my second spray tan. So makeup, second spray tan, posing session, and then athletes meeting. And then it'll be time to get on stage. Thank you all so much if you've been here since the beginning. Thank you if you just joined a few weeks ago or if this is your first video watching of mine, thank you. This is just the beginning. So go ahead and subscribe, stay a while, and I will talk to you all in my next video. Bye. <laughs>